Hey guys, Tabby here and welcome back to my channel. It is finally here. I cannot say how excited I am in words, but it's here. And it is Glitter Crate's Magical Edition box for year six. And look at the box this year. It is amazing. I'm sad it came a little dinged up, but it's like the pensive. And then we have some potion bottles, the Death Mark and Harry and Dumbledore flying to the tower. This is Dumbledore and Harry in the boat um, crossing the lake to get to the necklace. And of course, Malfoy leading the Death Eaters from the Vanishing Cabinet in the Room of Requirements. So I love the box this year. For those who don't know, Literary Crate is actually a book box subscription, but every year they make these special Harry Potter boxes, which they call Magical Edition. And they're always amazing. So my expectation is like super, super high. So yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and unbox this. So if you were interested, keep watching and let's get into it. Oh my gosh, okay. It is like Christmas. I need to calm down, okay. Sneak peek. Ooh, okay, so right on top. I'm assuming this is the spoiler card. Um, so yeah, we will save that for last. And right on top is a tote bag. Oh, and it's Fred and George, Wizard Weasley Wheezes. Oh, and it's like them in their shop. And on the back, it has like different products. The extendable ears, puking pastels, fever fudge, the cute pygmy puff. Oh, that is so cool. Oh, this is definitely my favorite tote ever. Oh, I love it. Okay, so that was the first item. Great start to the box. And next I see, oh, it's a love potion and it has like a little heart with some tassel. Oh, oh, it's a candle. Oh my God, it smells amazing. Oh, and it has some sparkle in there. Oh, I love that this is a candle. And next we have our very own Pygmy Puff. Oh, the perfect pet for any student. Warning, while you're sleeping, Pygmy Puffs may attempt to eat your earwax with their long tongues. Oh, and it has like caring for your Pygmy Puff. Oh, this is so cute. Oh, and we even have a certificate of adoption. So we have a little cage. And I have my own little pygmy puff with a Litger Crate tag. <laughs> I don't know if I want to keep it in its cage though. That's sad, but I love the pink cage. Hmm. Should I free the pygmy puff? Guys, let me know. Should I keep her in her cage or not? And let me know, what do you think I should name her? Because it's a she. And next we have bubble wrap. Woohoo! I actually love bubble wrap. Um, we have a little stand. So I'm assuming this is for something else in the box. Mm. And next we have a Litger Crate box. I'm assuming this is jewelry. <gasps> oh, holy rabies. It is the Slytherin locket. And we even have a little note that says, To the Dark Lord, I know I will be dead long before you read this, but I want you to know that it was I who discovered your secret. I have stolen the real Horcrux and intend to destroy it as soon as I can. I face death in the hope that when you meet your match, you will be mortal once more. R.A.B. This is gorgeous. Oh, it's tangled. Hold on. <laughs> I'm making it worse. Ha ha ha. Oh my gosh. It has the S with like green emeralds in there. Does it actually open? <gasps> and it actually opens. Oh, I love this so much. Hold on, I'm totally putting this on. Oh, and it's actually like longer. Oh, that is so cool. And I love that we have like a little note replica type thing. You guys know how much I love replicas. Oh, this is definitely my favorite item so far. And we're what, like three items in? <laughs> okay, next we have, ooh, a little brown box. Oh, you guys, it's a music box. And it has a fox on there. 
And when you lift it up, it says the one that loves us never really leaves us. Oh, I think this is the song that Fox like sings after Dumbledore dies. I absolutely love this. It is going next to my other little Harry Potter music box. Okay, ooh, and we have a another box. What are you? Oh, it's a little shot glass and more bubble wrap. And it says, farewell, Aragog, king of arachnids. Arachno arachnids? How did you say that, arachnids? And then it has like the spider on there. And it's gonna go next to my other shot glass that I got. I actually think I like this one more. And next we have, Ooh, it's an enamel pen by Dust and Pages. It is a pensive, and you guys, it actually spins. It says, into the pensive, and it has Dumbledore's wand on there. This is my favorite Harry Potter pen. That is so cool. Okay, wow. <sighs> and we still have tons of stuff, guys. And next we have Gaunt Family Ring Phone Stand. This is so cool. It really is just like a replica of the ring, but it's a phone stand. Oh, I'm so putting this on my phone, ASAP. And I love that the back of it is a triangle because it reminds me of the actual Deathly Hollows. This is awesome. And we have another box, but this one says, this book is the property of the Half-Blood Prince. So I'm assuming this is the potion book. It is, it's the advanced potion making, and I'm assuming it's a box. Oh my gosh, I'm assuming this is liquid luck, and I think this is what the stand was for, and it was. So we have liquid luck and its own little stand. That is actually freaking awesome. I kind of wish that this was actually like a potion and not just like beads and it had like a label. So I just kind of wish it was a little more authentic looking instead of just gold beads in there. I don't know if y'all can tell, but I mean it really does just look like gold little beads. I wish it was more potion looking, but I do love that we have a little stand for it. That is really cool. And so I'm assuming this comes out, yes. So now we have like a secret box hidden in our potion book and it actually looks like a book. This is awesome. Oh my gosh, okay. We still got some more stuff in here. So we have, ooh, it is a book sleeve. Hold on, get it out of the plastic. So this is obviously the Room of Requirements. You can see the Vanishing Cabinet and Draco, and then we have like the piles of hidden objects throughout the year. Looks like we have Dobby? Dobby? Yes, it looks like Dobby with all of the hats that Hermione has made for him. I don't know if that's supposed to be Hagrid, but you can see the potion book, some spiders. So yeah, it's actually a fairly big, book sleeve so I love it and if you've been following me for a while you guys know how much I love book sleeves so I'm a fan and next oh we have some magnetic bookmarks I was actually able to get some of the bookmarks from the past boxes that I missed but this one has it looks like lavender and it says I love Juan Juan and then we have Professor Slughorn as the chair and then we have Happy Christmas from the Burrow. That must be the gnome that they put instead of the angel on top of the tree. That is so freaking cute and I love magnetic bookmarks. And next we have some more trading cards for our collection. We have Professor Dumbledore with Fox in the corner. Then we have Professor Snape, Tom Riddle with the diary with the basilisk fang hanging out. We have Jenny Weasley with a pygmy puff on her shoulder and Gryffindor in the corner. Malfoy with Slytherin. Professor Slughorn with the liquid luck. Huh, I didn't get the golden snitch. I must have not did that right. So yes, more trading cards for my collection. I love it. And we have another brown package. It is a wood bookmark and it has Bellatrix Lestrange. 
and on the back it has them doing the unbreakable vow that is actually amazing I love how creepy and perfect this bookmark is Wow that's that's creepy I love it and next we have a silver envelope on the back we have professor slughorn Ooh. Let me see if I can open it without breaking it. Ah, <laughs> Oh, and it says you are cordially invited to a Christmas party hosted by Professor Slughorn. Oh, that is gorgeous. And it has like that silver foiling on there. The party will take place in Professor Slughorn's office at Hogwarts School of Witchcraft and Wizardry. Oh, I love this. Oh, that is so cool. Another replica. And last but not least is Professor Dumbledore's portrait that now hangs in his office. Oh, and it even has the Deathly Hollow symbol down here. And it's like on really good paper. Oh, Professor Dumbledore. So guys, that was it. That was everything from Ledger Crate Magical Edition Year 6. Wow. Just wow. Absolutely amazing. I loved everything. As always, you guys let me know what you think in the comments down below. What was your favorite item, least favorite? Um, definitely for me, the Slytherin Locket replica was my favorite item. I mean, just, just everything. This was such a great box. So guys, let's take a quick look at their little amazing pamphlet thing. And we have... Magical Edition, Crates, Year 6, Public Notice, Your Information is Vital, Death Eaters are Among Us, Help Us to Help You, <laughs> Advanced Potion Making Storage Book Box, Liquid Luck Bottle with Gold Stand, the Adopt the Pygmy Puff Pet, Weasley Wizard Wheezes Shopping Bag, the Slytherin Locket, which is my favorite item, Ooh, Warning, May Contain Dark Magic. The Unbreakable Vow would mark, warning, the wizard community is currently under threat from an organization calling itself the Death Eaters. If you have any information concerning Death Eaters, contact your nearest Aurora office. Bye. Then we have the Pensive Enamel Pin, the Trading Card Set of Six, the Love Potion Candle, the Gaunt Family Ring Phone Stand, Reward, the Ministry of Magic is offering a reward of 1,000 galleons for information leading directly to the arrest of any Death Eater. Then the Photo Challenge, Magical Edition Year 7, VIP Presale opens September 10th. Guys, remember that. The Magnetic Bookmark Set, the Slug Club Christmas Party Invite, the book sleeve, Hagrid's mini mug shot glass, I love that. The Dumbledore Headmaster portrait, the Phoenix music box, and that is it. That is a lot of items. That is why I totally think this box is worth the price because you get your money's worth and plus some. <sighs> Just amazing. Just amazing. But as always, thank you guys so much for watching. If you liked this video, give it a thumbs up. And if you're new to my channel, hey, welcome. Feel free to hit that subscribe button if you want to join my small community of Harry Potter lovers and bookworms. And I will see y'all next time. Bye, guys. <laughs> I even have like a certific certification, a certificate. Wow. Would you? I wish you would stay on my shoulder. No? No? No. no. If I can get it open. Okay. Breathe, Tabitha, breathe. <laughs> that is a merger. Put it on the old, blah, blah, blah. Mm, mm, well, it is a, I think I'm actually gonna put my liquid luck that I got from Geek Gear on here. What do you guys think? Which one do you think is better looking? I kind of like this one more. You guys let me know in the comments which one y'all think I should have displayed on this. Because they both fit. This one actually says liquid luck though. Good. Let me know. Oh, and there's more on the back. <laughs>